Welcome to Acupuncture Under Live Thermography, presented and developed by Dr. Anthony Piana. We will be demonstrating live thermography as a useful tool for the acupuncturist to refine his or her skills, as well as an excellent educational tool for your patients. Dr. Anthony Piana is the founder of GoThermoScan.com and Breast Thermography International. The setup included an ICI infrared 7320 camera temporarily mounted to the ceiling facing the acupuncture table. A large flat screen TV was placed on the wall so the acupuncturist could see the video as she needled the subjects. Our demo patient presented with excess heat in the liver, among other focal heat imbalances in the regions of the back. As, as you can see in this picture here, the arrow points to the excess liver heat. This is before treatment. There is also areas areas of patchy yellow heat as seen. If you look in the lateral and upper left scapula, which would be the right side of your screen, you can see the blue, which is considered to be cold. We will demonstrate how an acupuncturist would use thermography as a tool in locating where to needle and treat a patient. This acupuncturist is locating the exact point while watching the monitor on the wall. She is looking for the areas in the bladder meridian that she would like to needle. This is what it looked like as she was looking at it herself. She knows where to precisely place the needle where she wants it. You can see from the sequential pictures that there has already been some change. It's hard to picture the body's energy as dynamic when looking at a snapshot, but digital video thermography shows the flux of energy in the body as it changes over time. This is a before and after example of changes seen during treatment. Look at the arrow where the red was. Now look after adding the point how the red and yellows have dissipated and the patchiness has diminished considerably. Now the therapist is using the video screen to locate the focal heat associated with the small intestine point in the upper right scapula. You can see how precise the needle placement can be. This video shows the after effect of needling the point. Notice how cold the surrounding shoulder blades became in the purple after the segment of this of after the this segment of the treatment. Here again, look at the arrow where the point is. This is a before picture. And now look at the surrounding area in purple. You can see how it's made a considerable change in temperature in that area. Your imagination is certainly your limit with thermography and acupuncture. We have done these studies with no expectation of outcome. Picture what could become of the science of acupuncture with this technology. From what we have seen so far, the 4,000 years of clinical trials have been validated through modern science. I will now show you some images that clearly show imbalances in the body that are treatable by acupuncture. The arrow in this picture points alongside the spine. As I show you these pictures, imagine how you would treat the patient if this was a patient in your office. This woman's abdomen shows various focal heat signatures. She has been unsuccessful at bearing a child. She has been through numerous infertility treatments, including one with an acupuncturist. There are areas of, of imbalance as shown in the upper right area of her abdomen, the lower left, and right in the midsection above the pubic area. These may all be associated to, with organs of infertility. The hands in this picture are extremely cold in the lateral aspect. The associated meridian points can be needled and then reanalyzed each visit. Instant success can be evaluated.
This is the same patient with the hands turned the opposite direction. Note the focal hot spots on the anterior left hand. Acupuncture points on the face can easily be diagnosed. In this image, the points on the neck and upper back can be seen. What would you do here? This is another abdomen picture with focal heat abnormalities. Notice the red areas. Look well to the well points. The left hand well points are all very, very hypothermic, meaning cold. Also, look at the opposite hand with excess heat in it. What would you do here? This picture shows patchy heat in the abdomen. Also, take a look at the upper right shoulder compared to the left side. I will let you take a close look at this picture. I'm quite sure I don't need to say anything here. If you like what you've seen in this video, please pass it on to a colleague. If you're interested in talking to us more about thermography in your practice, please contact us. We have not even told you the best part about breast thermography, so read up online at btiscan.com and you can make a decision if this is something you would like to incorporate into your practice. You can reach us at 877-997-4262.